Hey everybody, welcome to my channel, it's Rebecca. Today we are reviewing Lawless Foundation. Put the bottle right side up, Rebecca, and front facing forward. <laughs> Hello. It's uh, it's awkward. It re it just really is. I can't I can't tell you. I can't not. Can't not. Okay. Yes. Like I said, I'm gonna do a foundation feature today. I have I've worn this uh, foundation a couple times already, so this isn't a first impression. But I will apply it for you, and you can see firsthand. All right. So let's talk about the Lawless Clean AF foundation seal the deal or I'm sorry it's called conceal the deal but the um, little logo kind of motto is clean AF it even says that here on the side of this thank you to Lawless for gifting me this they sent it to me so excited and I have shade sunlight which definitely my winter shade yeah so I could bump up one more shade, honestly, but I'll make this work. What this says for what it does, <laughs> it's that it's a matte self-setting foundation that is good for sensitive skin, that has a modern full coverage. So I think that means like not cakey, pasty thick, and also has blue light protection, antioxidants, things like that. So this is a very serum-like formula. <clears throat> Excuse me, comes in a plastic bottle. It is one ounce. It's made in Italy. And you gotta shake it, because it kind of separates. It's silicone-free. It's not oily, but it's kind of, kind of, yeah. <laughs> okay, so I'll show you. A little goes a long way is my experience so here we are with the shade and like it looks perfect but it's just a bit it's just a bit pale I don't it doesn't oxidize so I mean I'm definitely I need to go up a shade as you can tell it is too pale but I wore this in my video that I did my drugstore product favorites oh apparently I'm putting it on with my fingers um, just talking and, um, kind of want to do a brush. Hang on. I'm going to take my Real Techniques face, what is this called again? I love this, Instapop face brush. Okay. And I'm going to just kind of, it works really nicely with a brush to smooth the product over the skin and it doesn't do like track marks. I have lost eyelashes. <laughs> oh look, let's make a wish. You lost an eyelash. I wish to not lose more lashes. Yeah, it says it's self-setting and I gotta say it pretty much is. My only thing was it does like to go into my forehead creases if I'm expressive and I haven't set it with powder um, and I start talking. Okay, so nice, nice spreads evenly, spreads quickly. I'm wearing my MD Solar Sciences Mineral Tinted SPF, which has a slip to it. It kind of has this um, slippery, doesn't really dry down. All right, so I do like a brush and I'm gonna leave that. So I'm gonna leave that like so. What I'm gonna do for you guys is I'm going to put my makeup on and then I'm gonna come back and share the finish, how it feels, and then I will give you a six hour, eight hour, whatever it is, end of day check-in, real nice and close with some bad lighting so that you can see it kind of, you know, <laughs> the reality of it. But I like this, I really do like this. It's a nice finish. It's a really pretty formula. Um, it works with my skin that's dry with a bit of wrinkling. So I think this is kind of maybe something good for a lot of folks. 
But uh, let me finish my face and I'll be back. I am back and so far so good, right? Um, <laughs> uh, I got mascara in my hair. How many times do you do that? I swear, I've done that since high school. <laughs> and I uh, burned myself with my curling iron right here. Not a hickey. Well, so Lawless Seal the Deal Foundation, I'm digging ya. I'm really digging ya. This is good stuff. So I will walk around, walk around. I'm just gonna walk around. I'm gonna go about my day and then I will give you a check in. I did a video on my phone really close because my camera doesn't, uh, if you get that close, it doesn't focus anymore. So I got really close on my phone. And so that's right there. And I think it's good. And I also think it passed the flash test. I barely powdered. I just added a little bit of pressed powder right here where my forehead creases are. And I think I, I'm wearing the Haley's concealer and I think I put on like a little bit of powder right here. But for the most part, I'm not wearing powder and it did a good job. So maybe if you're more oily, you would need to set it a bit more with powder. We'll see what kind of breakthrough shine happens today. Um, we, it's not like a hot day. So if it was like a hot, humid day, it would probably be different. So we'll just wait and see. And I think this is great. I will link everything below and I will say all this again later. Ah, okay, I'll see you later. Okay, here I am. I told you I'm just gonna look, oops, sorry, that's my microphone. I'm just gonna look a little, okay. So long story short, I really like this foundation. This is good stuff. This is no joke. Long wear, it feels really comfortable on my skin. It didn't do anything weird. It's actually really smooth on my forehead um, where I thought it would crease. And even though I, I just applied a tiny bit of powder, it's done great. I haven't touched up at all today. If it was a hotter, humider day, I said that I would probably feel the need, but we're actually getting into that type of weather right now where my skin my dry skin is now going to start feeling dry all summer. It's felt kind of just comfortable. So, um, this did feel comfortable though. I don't feel dry. It's great. And I did not use primer, just SPF. Even, I think you guys, you've seen me do these videos. You know, when I get red around my nose and chin, I mean, my chin has a little bit of wear. Also, a couple things to note that I think give credence to this foundation. I wore a mask for a little bit, so I took a picture in my car after I took off my mask so you could see. There was zero like indentations or demarcations from the mask, and I fell asleep. I took a nap on the couch today for probably 20, 30 minutes, just kind of against a cushion, like so, and everything still looks good. So I think, I, you know, sometimes that can kind of mesh up <laughs> and I look fine. I've even had wine and alcohol and I don't look flushed. It's like covering everything up. Yeah, no, I like it. And I definitely prefer putting it on with a brush versus fingers. So, and I think it's worth maybe getting another shade so I can um, create, I mean, it kind of works though for, We'll see, we'll see. Okay, so thanks so much. I hope this was fun for you. Again, thank you, Lawless, for gifting this to me. And I will link it below where you can get it. I think on Sephora is where I've seen it. And what else? Click like, subscribe, leave me a comment, and thanks so much. I'll see you next time, bye.